Hi, I'm Roger Brogan, Director of Solutions Architecture at Chainlink Labs, and today we're going to be discussing Chainlink Proof of Reserve. Chainlink is the industry standard for essential infrastructure and services in Web3. With over 1,000 decentralized Oracle networks providing more than 5 billion data points on chain, as well as critical services such as automation and randomness. Today, we're going to be talking about Chainlink Proof of Reserve. We're going to explain what is Chainlink Proof of Reserve, how it enhances transparency, and how it sets the foundation for a new wave of trust-minimized applications. We're also going to see why it is an essential building block for Web3 going forward. Over the past several years, we've witnessed massive growth in on-chain tokenization. From stable coins and tokenized commodities to wrapped and cross-chain assets, and we're just scratching the surface. Today, gold, currencies, real estate, and commodities are worth over 40 trillion. However, only approximately 200 billion of that is currently represented as tokenized assets on-chain. Now that's just 0.05% of the addressable market. What does that mean? It means a tremendous opportunity for growth. But there is a problem. Blockchains can't verify if these tokenized assets are fully backed. Neither can the protocols that are built around them or those that use them. Without on-chain transparency, users are forced to rely on the promises and reputation of the protocols, dApps, and exchanges that they use. What's needed are verifiable guarantees regarding the underlying reserve data of these assets. This is what Chainlink Proof of Reserve does. Proof of Reserve is a new standard for verifying off-chain and cross-chain assets based on user demand for security and transparency. Proof of Reserve leverages the same Chainlink Oracle infrastructure that has already helped enable trillions of dollars in transactional value to reliably and timely report reserve data using automated attestations. Simply put, Proof Reserve feeds provide blockchains with the data smart contracts need to verify tokens backing. As Web3 grows in complexity and developers build increasingly sophisticated financial products, there is a growing need for a reliable, transparent, and decentralized standard to help verify the reserve assets backing wrapped or cross-chain tokens. With Proof of Reserve, users, protocols, and issuers no longer need to trust a single party or monthly audits. Instead, Chainlink Proof Reserve provides a superior and automated way to verify an asset's underlying collateralization. Proof of Reserve is helping developers build the future of Web3 across several use cases, including real-world assets, stable coins, wrapped assets, and cross-chain bridges. Proof Reserve utilizes Chainlink's blockchain agnostic Oracle infrastructure. And here are the four main steps in the Proof of Reserve process. Step one, Proof of Reserve leverages the same Chainlink DAWN architecture and process that helps secure tens of billions in DeFi. Step two, the DAWN continuously monitors reserve balances through an API connected to an external adapter. Step three, the Proof of Reserve feed is then updated based on either a predetermined deviation threshold or heartbeat time interval. Step four, this enables real-time verification with fresh data the moment you need it. Proof of Reserve can be applied to both off-chain and cross-chain use cases. In off-chain Proof of Reserve, Chainlink node operators pull data from auditors, custodians, and even vaults. This could be the balance of fiat currencies in an account, or could also be the measure of gold secured in a real-world vault. With cross-chain Proof of Reserve, Chainlink nodes monitor and report data across multiple blockchains. Now, this can be used to check collateralization for tokens like wrapped Bitcoin, and it can also be used to help verify the collateralization of bridges. And this is just the start. Chainlink Proof of Reserve infrastructure helps enable the secure tokenization of a range of new assets. This could even include things like paintings, wine, or memorabilia. Proof of Reserve provides transparency on the number of tokens locked in the original blockchain and the tokens minted on the destination blockchain. So any user or dApp can verify the collateral backing the token on the destination chain. 
It also adds extra security when implemented into the minting function of these assets, with users able only to mint as many tokens as there are in the reserves and no more. Chainlink Proof Reserve is essential infrastructure as a security layer for the next generation of Web3 products and use cases. Check out our documentation, ask a question in Discord, or set up a call with an expert. Thanks for watching.